ऑलवेज लर्न फ्रॉम ट्रस्टेड एंड सर्टिफाइड पर्सन इंस्टेड ऑफ अनट्रस्टेड सोर्स और अनसर्टिफाइड पर्सन बिकॉज लर्निंग फ्रॉम अनट्रस्टेड सोर्स कैन पुट योर रिस्क ऑफ पासिंग दिस एग्जाम इफ यू मिस क्वेश्चन नंबर वन टू सेवेंटी प्लीज चेक प्रीवियस पास और सीरीज लेट्स मार्क द की वर्ड्स वन एवर यू सी की वर्ड्स लाइक टीबल्स रेसेप्ट और इन वॉइस इन द क्वेश्चन दैन थिंक अबाउट ए आई डॉक्यूमेंट इंटेलिजेंस विच वॉज प्रीवियसली नोन एज फ्यू ईयर्स बैक एज अ फॉर्म रिकोगनाइजर एंड यू शुड गेट योर आंसर सो विल रिजेक्ट रेस्ट ऑफ द ऑप्शन इफ यू लुक एट द ऑफिशियल डॉक्यूमेंटेशन इट्स रिटर्न एक्यूरेटली एक्सट्रैक्ट टेक्सट की वैल्यू पेज एंड टेबल्स फ्रॉम डॉक्यूमेंट्स फॉर्म्स रिसिप्ट इन वॉइस एंड कार्ड्स ऑफ वेरियस टाइप्स विदाउट मैनुअल लेबलिंग बाई डॉक्यूमेंट टाइप intensive coding or maintenance use ai document intelligence you can have a read at this this is uh, very useful you might get several questions related to it and you need to apply the concept similarly we'll test this concept in later in this part as well so i want you to pay attention at this so in the interest of time i will lock ai document intelligence as the correct answer for this all right this question is some what related to the hands on if you have done hands on in real time that is production environment then you might be knowing the answer let's look at option c and d first c says model evolution and model training so only two options are valid when it comes to deploying inference pipeline maybe in production development or testing these two options model evolution and model training are invalid only two options which qualifies are azure container instances and azure kubernetes services will reject this for the time being i have made a keynote here which you can refer that is in production on real time the question is looking for real time as you can see uh, it's the answer should be azure kubernetes service also known as eks when it is development or testing the answer should be azure container instance so you got the concept i hope as uh, mentioned in the keynote here will reject option a and lock option b that is azure kubernetes service as the correct answer for this okay i think you might be already knowing the answer by looking at the keyword that is predict how many hours which is nothing but a numerical value i have given you a much hint so let's first look at option c and d if you still haven't got c says clustering d says all of the above whenever you see keywords like predict or forecast in the question then only two options are qualify for the correct answer that is one is regression second is classification hence we'll reject c and d for the timing let's now move to option b b says classification since we don't need to categorize if we read the question it's saying how many hours it's not asking for any kind of yes or no values so classification comes into picture when we need any kind of like yes no or like a low medium high those kind of categorization thing but the question is not looking for any kind of categorization instead it's looking for numerical value where regression comes into picture so it's easy we'll reject this and i hope you got the concept since we need to predict or forecast a numerical value as per the question hence regression is the correct answer let's bring the heat to the snow and will understand the question first early detection in the question here marked as the keyword it means we need to forecast or predict different brain issue types so only qualified options as mentioned in the previous question as well we are left out with regression and classification so c and d are again out and now let's focus on option a and b now since the question is looking for non numerical value if you try to understand it's looking for non numerical value so we need to categorize different brain issue types hence regression is out we are left out with classification and it is the correct answer all righty this should be bit tricky if you are know the concept it should be easy so let's first look at option c and d c and d c says ai translator d says speech ai translator and speech services are no way related to image processing question is about 
processing images or image processing so we'll eliminate this for the time being now let's focus on option a first a says computer vision so computer vision can identify very basic things like the brand logos but cases where custom model is required as per the question if you look here the keyword then custom vision is required computer vision won't work just remember custom model if keyword is mentioned custom vision should be the answer so we'll reject option a we are left off with option b that is custom vision and it is the correct answer we have encountered a similar question in i think question number 71 so this should be a piece of cake because just by looking at the keyword that is recipe you should be knowing the answer already since the keyword is recipe hence the correct answer is option d that is ei document intelligence we saw few moments back in the official documentation about it entire paragraph so we'll reject option a b and c and if you look here again for if you want to recall you can have a read at this i have already went through in question number 71 we'll lock option d as the correct answer all right we need hands on experience in order to answer these types of question so i know it's a basic or fundamental level of azure so uh, everyone uh, might not be aware of the hands on but um, uh, still some questions are there in the actual question where you need some kind of hands on practice to tackle the question so if you have already done the hands on then usually we do 70% and 30% train test split to split that data set into train and test sets that is option c this is to test the model using data which isn't been used to train the model this is the purpose of it so we'll reject option a b and c, uh, d and lock option c as the correct answer okay this seems to be a real life question because the question is about home loans which is very popular nowadays so it's about predicting another keyword so by looking at the predicting we know c and d are out because c c is clustering d c is none of the option which isn't true because a and b contains classification and regression we'll focus on this now now let's understand the question the question is looking for yes or no value that is whether the home loan will be repaid or not that is home loan will be repaid yes or no since we need to categorize things so classification comes into picture if the question was about some numerical value that is any kind of uh, amount the loan amount then regression would have been the answer but for now since we need to categorize whether the loan will be repaid or not that is a yes or no so classification is the correct answer let's bring the heat to the snow the question is about predicting sea level in meters if you're finding my explanation useful then please hit the thumbs up button because it gives me immense motivation because i'm bringing out free videos for you uh, to share my knowledge if you have got the concept of regression from my previous videos then this question should be definitely easy for you since we need to predict the sea level in meters just note this word meters it meter means a numerical value right so when we need to predict predict just two option qualifies as mentioned classification and regression and now the numerical value is there so regression comes into picture we'll reject rest of the option and lock option b regression as the correct answer this seems to be a brainstorming question it should be easy if you have already done the hands-on because i know uh, these things are covered in the hands-on so anyways let's first dive into option a e says first name if we look at the data in the table this is the data then the first name are definitely different for everyone using first name is of no use for a data scientist when it comes to forecasting monthly income as per the question option a is definitely out now let's move to option b b says monthly income ah uh, uh, this is incorrect because you know the question itself is looking for forecasting the monthly income how can this be the answer because the question is looking for future so monthly income is instead a label and not a feature because we need to forecast the monthly income itself 
as per the question just remember if you are confused whenever a column name is mentioned in the question which uh, where, where we need to forecast or which we need to forecast in this case is monthly income then it becomes the label hence we'll reject this option because the question is looking for feature and not label b is out we are automatically left out with two of the correct answer since qualification a level if you look and ages are the characteristics of the users to find out the monthly income so these becomes the feature automatically just remember features are nothing but characteristics so we'll lock option c and d so please 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 don't go away let's meet in next part of the series which got to be more interesting